Ready? Okay, let's go ahead and call the meeting to order. I pledge allegiance to the flag of the United States of America, and to the republic for which it stands, one nation under God, indivisible, with liberty and justice for all. Okay, this is an administration meeting. <laughs> I'll try that again in English. Uh, this is an administrative meeting of the Board of Commissioners. I want to thank everybody for attending with the social distancing and all. Uh, just a reminder, this is a public meeting, and um, please come to the microphone and state who you are if you have business. And... Mr. Chair, we... Uh, as you know, we've been getting lots of requests for information uh, about different issues, and, and we did get a request from uh, Doug Corey, uh, one of those people requesting information from the commissioners. And so uh, a letter has been prepared, and I move that the commissioners uh, approve sending this letter signed by our chair. Second. Okay. The motion was made and second. All in favor of the motion say aye. 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 Motion carries. Okay, uh, clinic HP position. That's the health clinic one. Did you want? Yeah, uh, yeah. Typ typically, uh, we have contracted for a nurse practitioner, and we have gone to uh, extensive lengths uh, trying to find an, a nurse practitioner we could contract with. We have not uh, been able to do so. Uh, so, but we do have uh, an individual who's willing to work part-time in the same amount of capacity as a nurse practitioner for us. They're very, very difficult to find, and I think this is hardly the time we would ever think of, of reducing our uh, medical staff or our ability to respond to the needs of the community. So I would move that we uh, engage the nurse practitioner. I would second the motion. Okay, got a motion and a second. Any further discussion? All in favor of the motion say aye. 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 The motion carries. And guidelines for reopening. I don't think those are any secret to anyone. Uh, they are, they have been vetted uh, in staff meetings and they have been vetted with our uh, director of public health, our medical director, um, and have been sent to the governor uh, at the request of both the governor's office and uh, AOC. Uh, I, you've all seen them. I won't go through them in detail, um, but all counties have been asked to do it. Counties are starting now to do it. There's a, we're not the only one that has done it. Uh, in fact, this afternoon at 2.30, uh, I'm on a call with Tina Edland. It's not one of those 100 commissioner calls. It's just myself and Tina Edland. <coughs> She's the, the governor's uh, head policy director for public health. Uh, I don't know what the call is about. I'm hopeful that she's just going to ask uh, some basic questions and, and perhaps that might even be the avenue for approval of our guidelines for reopening. So with that, I move we adopt it. And these uh, generally follow the outline that was laid out by the president and by the governor who followed <laughs> yeah. that outline and we've pretty well followed the same outline in general. And anyone who might be watching this, I would invite them to go to the county's website, download a copy if they're interested in finding out how this is going to roll out. And I would second the most. Sure, it was an interesting, it was an interesting uh, exercise balancing uh, the directives of President Trump and Governor Brown. But I believe we've done <laughs> it. <laughs> so. But generally, following. Yeah, yeah, I know. And it's only this long. That's. <laughs> So we have a I've been discouraged by a member of our staff from writing really, really long memos. So. <laughs> <laughs> and probably a couple of commissioners, too. <laughs> oh. <laughs> so a motion's been made. Is there a second? <laughs> there was. There was. Okay. Motion and second. All in favor of the motion say aye. 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 Motion carries. Okay. And the work schedule. <laughs> You're on a roll. Did you want to just keep around oh, on the sure. Um we have, for the last four weeks, had a uh, special work 
schedule that is provided for uh, a much smaller pr footprint of our staff uh, trying to prevent uh, should heaven forbid there ever be a, a case in the courthouse uh, having a smaller footprint at any given time having uh, portions of our staff not here uh, we've Im implemented that schedule uh, for four weeks it was scheduled to end uh, I would propose that uh, we extend that until um, be approximately the same time as our proposal for reopening uh, I believe it would end on the 15th and all staff would be back on the 18th okay so Jennifer just is that correct to clarify the 15th is a Friday right and so that would be the last day Okay, so the 18th, that following Monday, we'd be back to full staffing levels. Right. Okay. And you made that motion? Uh-huh. Yeah, I was just reading this again. I'll, I'll second that. This extends what we had already previously done. Right. There's no wording change. Yes. Other than the date. Okay, you got a motion and a second. All fair of the motion say aye. 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 Motion carries. Okay, we do not have an executive session, so we are adjourned.